Hello and welcome! Yesterday I realized that sophomore year is coming to a close and I started packing. I need boxes. I'm gonna go get boxes from AES right now because they're giving out free boxes. Come with me. Yes, it's true that I once went through life as a guy who always had to rhyme life with a strike. Yes, I've been burning, I've been spurning through it all. Yes, I have learned that love is not about whether you get stabbed at all. <laughs> <laughs> More boxes. Because you can't hit the night. If you lived your whole life without life, you can't hit the dish. You've only ever eaten fish and you can't feel alone if it's all you've ever known. Yeah, the deep sea angler fish have their day two or three of packing, I can't remember. It's starting to look uh, well the walls are still up. But there are more things in boxes and it's starting to look a lot more bare. Uh, and it still feels really weird. <laughs> I put all my books on my bookshelf away. Those are the ones that I'm keeping for this summer because I want to read a lot over the summer. But I want to show you that I am taking down the lights, which is a very sad occasion. End of day two and or three of packing. My desk is still a mess. My laundry baskets are under the desk um, and my chair is now in my closet. So clearly I'm making a huge mess of things. It also means I'm not studying for finals, which sucks. I don't really have to study for finals, I just have to write two papers. I have a very easy final schedule this semester, which is very, very nice. I have two papers uh, to write, two 10-page papers, but one of them is a rewrite of a 10-page paper. Um, so I actually have it pretty easy this finals period. It makes me feel really bad when other people around me are like, oh, I'm like dying of finals, and I'm like, yeah about that. I just wanted to point out how crazy my hair is right now. Look at that, it's cray cray. Look at those curls. Also I'm wearing glasses. I wear glasses. Day three of packing. I am making progress, yay. I am not looking forward to putting all of those down because that's going to take a very long time. Um, I'm probably going to keep the wall posted up until the very end, uh, but I want to finish packing all the things that I can pack today uh, so that tomorrow I can finally start working on my papers. Um, Yes. Day four and or five of packing. All right, bro. Time has come. The stuff must come off the walls. Yes, it's true that I once went through life as a guy who always had to rhyme life with a strife. Yes, I've been burning, I've been spurning through it all. Yes, I have learned that love is not about whether you get stabbed or slow the knife gets stirred. But my friends, I found an animal who doesn't feel this pain in my life is so much better. Without light, you can't eat the dish. You've only ever eaten fish, and you can't feel alone if it's all you've ever known. Yeah, the deep sea angler fish have no reason to be happy, but it has no freaking idea what else to be. The deep sea dwelling angler fish never has to find a mate, they are always there together when it's time to procreate. See one dark night, a young that bites the female on her side, and then slowly he becomes a sperm producing parasite. I don't know what day it is of packing. Took a break for a few days so that I could work on my finals, and you know actually do what I was supposed to do during finals week, but now I'm back to packing. And it's still empty as ever, and it feels very weird. Today I say bye to all my friends because they're all leaving. And if we could say he lives it all, he lives until she dies, and until that day he literally never leaves her side. Yeah, you can't hit the night. If you lived your whole life without lighting, you can't hit the dish. You've only ever eaten fish, and you can't feel alone if it's all you've ever known. I'm finished packing. Do you hear the echo? This is no longer my room. Feels really odd. Feels very foreign. Taking down everything from the walls makes it feel no longer mine. Which sort of makes me think about what is it that makes a place ours. This is my last time leaving Stearns as a resident after two beautiful years. 